Hello everyone, my name is Claire Babin and I'm French teacher at the UTPL University in Southern Ecuador. Do you know how challenging can be to teach French almost 10,000 kilometers away from France? That's why with my team, Raphael Jamar, a French teacher, and Paola Sarango, a specialist in new technologies for teaching, we're thinking about some solution. And the result is the article called Students' Acceptance and Efficiency of Virtual Reality for French Learners at Higher Education. What better place than a university involved in innovation and use of new technologies to be at the cutting edge of technology? Seven years ago, UTPL began to invest in immersive technologies such as remote laboratories, virtual and augmented reality, and even telepresence through holograms. We decided to involve on-site French student beginners at our university to practice the French language through the use of 3D glasses and the app Mondly in 2019. The investigation in French language learning is still unusual, especially in the virtual reality field. As committed teachers, we are responsible for making any necessary teaching adaptations to worldly changes. And that's exactly what we did by learning and using this app and 3D glasses as smart devices and complementary to our teaching contents in class. The lack of native speakers is also a problem and virtual reality is a great solution to immerse students in a French-speaking world. Monly permits the user practicing the language in real conditions and simulated environments through voice recognition and improve their oral communication skills and for students to be the real actor of its learning process. During the last two years, VR is getting more and more used by different fields of research. But in foreign language, teaching not so much, most of the time for the lack of devices and knowledge. The objective of this research was to know the general perception of some students through the Davis model, called also TAM model. This model predicts individual adoption and use of new technologies. The intention to use new technology is based on two factors, perceived usefulness and perceived ease of use. The perceived ease of use represents the belief that using a particular system would be free of effort or simple to use. And the perceived usefulness is how a person believes that using a system would help his or her language learning performances. One big challenge was also to articulate the use of this app smartly in class to make it worth it. The methodology was so important to wake up the students' motivation and make them active learners of the language. 30 students of A1.1 level participated in the pretest and 17 in the practices with the app and the post test. Then, the efficiency of the app and use of 3D glasses were analyzed thanks to the statistic test of Man with Neyu. The general perception about VR use is that it makes a positive contribution to French learning. In terms of acceptance, students noted that thanks to immersion in a 3D virtual world with speech recognition, it's possible to learn a foreign language without physical boundaries and thanks to concrete communication situations. Technology in language learning motivates and stimulates students through this unique experience. If you have any additional questions or would be interested to work with us, I let you my email address. Thank you very much or merci. Take care and bye bye.